hello so in this video i'll explain you about the admin panel or uh, merchant account which india Creek is offering so whenever you purchase any product with the india Creek, you get an email which has a login credential for this admin panel account so with that email you get an email and a password so with this uh, login credential you can log in into your admin panel so for that you can uh, directly visit to www.indiacreek.com slash merchant you will get this page so this i'm loading so this is the admin panel for the for your india Creek product so i'm just i'm just logging with with my demo credential which is vibo platinum at the red gmail.com slash with the password i got an email okay okay i logged in into my account uh i already have created one tournament which is web of platinum one and uh, it was from uh, 16th of august to 29th of august and uh, it, which is already passed so that we have uh, called it as expert tournament so in the admin panel you get a profile so here uh, full name my general account details and uh, address details organization details here my purchase history so this tells you all the things about your purchase details so on the date of 31st 1st of august i uh, created uh, this account and uh, this is platinum package this is year this i created for the yearly basis 2019 is my expiry date so here one more detail is missing which is pending tournaments as this is platinum account you don't have any pending tournament kind of things because you can create unlimited tournament with this account but if you go with the golden basic uh, uh, package uh, or a basic type of uh, account then uh, you will have a pending tournament thing so with this account you can create a, a, a limited uh, tournaments with your account but with the platinum you don't have any limitation you can create an un unlimited uh, uh, tournaments and also with the themes see this is the theme section here you have a you can see all themes free and these are the premium theme as well and uh, even we launch any new theme you will have access for that theme as well so that that we are providing in this platinum package only so in this video i'll show you how about how to create a new tournament and uh, how you can add uh, score services uh, score system things score system things we will explain you in another video but in this video we will show you about how to create a new tournament so in uh, live tournament section also and uh, in uh, tournament section also you will see these two buttons add new tournament and in live tournament also you will see this button uh, add new uh, tournament and in below you will get uh, the list of live tournaments and the tournaments which are coming soon so these are only uh, tournaments which are created by you only so i'll so i'll just go through the add new tournament the one thing you have to uh, think about the bef uh, before uh, creating new tournament so you always have to see your pending tournament quota as i already explained this is platinum account so you don't have any pending tournament quota but if you or the basic or uh, gold uh, package then you all uh, always have to see your pending tournament quota if it is zero then you have to see our add-on package there uh, you will get the, the uh, tournament increase quota so with that you have to make it more than zero so then only you can proceed with the add new tournament else you will uh, prompt to add uh, tournaments and the another thing is you are expiry date so my expiry date is 2019 in august so that is also pretty well 
I can proceed with the add new tournament so let's add a new tournament oh I got an error again one of your recent tournament is expired you cannot create new tournament unless you clear recent tournament so this is unlo this is also a thing that you have to think about you should not uh, uh, you have to clear all your expired tournament so this tournament is already expired on 29th of August and today is 31st of August so you have to clear this tournament using this button it says it clearly says this is tournament this tournament is expired and you have to complete this tournament detail using clear button so I just click on clear button here so all the details best batsman best batsman I'll add okay this is the things next oh who's the winner first so this is the winner okay so only the players who got awards and what kind of awards they got and the winners oh which team got rank one which team got rank two these are the details that you have to fill in this complete tournament section next yes you are done okay so now you don't have any past tournament you you are cleared So add new tournament. Mm -hmm. so let's select Maharashtra. So on the basis of your state, you will get the list of cities over here. Select Navi Mumbai. Yeah, you can uh, select the town of your city. So within Navi Mumbai there are number of towns. So I'll just select the Cooper Kearney. So this is coming in the list uh, because we I already have added this uh, town inside of Navi Mumbai. So I'll just I can directly select from the list. So again I got a not this uh, ground detail from the list if you don't if you are uh, if your match is um, held as another ground then i can also add this like uh, mm -hmm. just select demo maidan of go per here ne? that's it let's select this tournament is on first be starting on first and ending on two you can add any description about this tournament here yeah, I'm uh, just adding lowering eclipse content select format so maybe it is rubber tennis or leather so I just select uh, leather select scope if it is within city the players which are uh, playing this tournament are within the cities or the players which are uh, playing this tournament or the teams which are uh, participating in this tournaments they are within state and India that is called open if the players are coming from the other country then you can set it as international so here I'm just setting it as open so the my tournament scope is through all over India the time the time zone of the tournament so I just select day if you are a YouTube broadcaster and uh, you are making this tournament on air through your Facebook or uh, YouTube or any other social media and you want this uh, uh, our India Creek live overlay on your YouTube section then you have to select yes yes I'm going to show this tournament live on YouTube so this indicates this thing here so you're done with this detail name state city town ground starting date ending date your description format your scope of the tournament time zone whether it is live on youtube or not then select yes and the next thing is commentators who are the commentators so i just just demo demo one enter 
another commenter is demo demo to enter the organizers i'll just add suppose some demo voice group this is my organizer or any, any other thing than multiples if there are multiples organizers you can add their details next so here i can add tournament form i just add some demo form over here if i have something so this is my tournament form this is the banner that i would like to upload uh, okay i'm done with the tournament form and banner so this is tournament lots this uh, this is also called as schedule tournament schedule so which teams are playing against which teams so that this uh, images you have to upload over here i think i don't have a... so let's add some uh, demo images only Let's add this. Uh, this so these are the demo I'm uploading. So lots. This is the thing that you have to should do here. So these are the list of themes, and uh, you have to select only one theme out of this. So I'll select my premium theme, same theme six, theme updated. So this theme six is allocated to my this platinum Vibo platinum one tournament. next generate your login details so this will generate your login details for your scorebook panel and that is only a link to this your this particular tournament so this will give you a detail about the dashboard uh, and these are your username and password so if you are uh, Uh, admin you can directly copy and paste this details and you can directly send it to your resource if you are handling this uh, uh, scorebook panel then you own directly you see so so here you uh, again in tournament you got the list why of platinum one this this are you can directly edit this tournament through this button here or you can select any other theme suppose i want to select theme 5 to this tournament you can do this directly through this page so this is added and this is select theme so you can add to your scorebook panel through two ways you have two ways this is the login credential username and password and this is the go to scorebook button so through this button also you can uh, add to your scorebook panel so i have directly added uh, logged in into my scorebook panel for this particular tournament or if you not going to operate your scorebook panel or uh, you want to share this uh, login detail of your scorebook panel to add your resource just click over here see the login details and you have to enter uh, it's at in www.indiacricket.com/dashboard okay so this is how you get the login panel so i just copy this details okay this is my username and then this is my password so this is how your resource can logged in into our account you just have to share url which is indiacric.com/dashboard or the login credential which you have generated for this particular tournament so this are the details that we have to share so your uh, resource will handle all the live score of your tournament
so you finally created a tournament vibo platinum one you have also selected uh, a theme for that from the admin panel so this is so that's done with the creating new tournament thank you